So during December, I'm going to be doing an ugly sweater party. And what this is, is uh, jerseys from 32 jerseys, one from all NHL teams, and then an all-star jersey thrown in there. And you guys vote on which jersey is the ugliest. And every every round, we get a new set of jerseys. So we'll have 32 jerseys, 16 matchups this round. And then in the next round, it would be the 16 jerseys that won, 8 matchups. And then the next round, 8 jerseys that won, 4 matchups, and so on. Till we finally determine which jersey is the ugliest. So the way I chose the jerseys isn't really a matter of personal opinion, it's just these are the jerseys that I find the most complaint about. And sometimes, like, some teams don't have really ugly jerseys, so sometimes it's just a jersey that's different, and it might be a good jersey, and uh, that just means it's not going to get that far in the tournament. So our first matchup is the Anaheim Ducks versus the Arizona Coyotes. Or the Mighty Ducks of Anaheim versus the Phoenix Coyotes. We have this Wild Wing jersey over here. And we have the Kachina Desert jersey over here. Both jerseys are very infamous. And uh, no one really seems to like them. Here we have the Calgary Flames and Edmonton Oilers. We have this Flames horse jersey going up against this Oilers oil drill jersey then we have the sharks and the kings for the kings they have uh the burger king jersey from the 90s that nobody really liked and the sharks uh they have their current alternate jersey and so canucks versus golden knights for the canucks i use this yellow jersey because no one really seems to like those. And then the Knights have really only had, only have two uniforms. One of them is white, and there's not really much to complain about with that. So I don't know, maybe some people find these ugly. So we move on to the Central Division with the Blackhawks and the Avalanche. The Blackhawks have their Winter Classic jersey from a few years ago, and the Avalanche have this alternate jersey. Neither of them do I find bad, but neither of these teams really have any horrendous jerseys, so that's what we got. So for the Stars and Wild, we have this alternate jersey from the 2006 season. And then for the Wild, we have this alternate jersey. I don't, I personally don't find this one that bad, but the Wild don't have any really bad jerseys, so... You know, I just went with this one because, I don't know, if people here don't like horizontal text, then teams with horizontal text alternates are just going to be screwed. Blues and Predators. With the Predators, I got the Mustard alternate from a few years back. And from the Blues, I had their 90s jersey. The Blues did have a really ugly jersey with a trumpet and some music notes, but... The Blues never actually wore that jersey, so I couldn't really count it. And then during the with the Jets and then the All Stars, the Jets current alternate and this All Star uniform from a few years ago. So as we move to the Eastern Conference, we got the Bruins and the Sabers, and we got this thing. And we have this other thing. And, uh... Yeah, these are really the two jerseys that I see the most complaint about from either of these two teams. We move on to the Panthers and Red Wings. We got this, uh... Detroit Cougars jersey. I wasn't counting jerseys from, like, the previous incarnations. So the... Hartford Whalers the North Stars, or the Quebec Nordiques, or the original Winnipeg Jets. But since the Red Wings never moved from De from Detroit, they just changed their name from the Cougars to the Red Wings. I'm still counting this jersey. 
And then this is the jersey I got from the Panthers. And then Canadians and Senators. We have this Canadians alternate that they had a few years ago. And then we have this Senators alternate that they had a few years ago. Maple Leafs and Lightning. With the Maple Leafs, it's kind of the same deal with the Red Wings. They never, they never moved. They just changed from St. Pat's to Maple Leafs. And this is the Lightning jersey that I chose. So Hurricanes and Blue Jackets. Uh, I just picked their two current alternate jerseys because neither of these teams have horrifically bad jerseys. So Devils and Islanders, I picked this nine the nineties Devils home jersey and this Islanders home jersey. This is a Devils jersey. If I said Islanders, I made a mistake. Flyers and Rangers, I picked the Statue of Liberty jersey from the Rangers and the Flyers current alternate. So our last matchup is the Capitals and the Penguins. The Penguins have this jersey from the 90s, and the Capitals have this jersey from the 2000s. And that's, uh... Yeah, that's it. That's where we're gonna end up. So, for voting... Don't, like, comment who you vote for. I'm gonna... In the comment section, I'm gonna post the... The names of every team, and then like the comment if you vote for that jersey... And remember, you're voting for the uglier jersey. Vote for which jersey you think is ugliest. And then... Uh, we'll probably have the next episode. The next matchup. Probably... Uh, not this upcoming Tuesday, but next Tuesday. And that'll be... That'll be the, um, ugly sweater party.